Kentucky back in 49, went to Detroit, working on assembly line. First year they had me putting wheels on the Cadillacs. Every day I'd watch them beauties roll by, and sometimes I'd hang my head and cry, because I always wanted me one that was long and black. One day I devised myself a plan that should be the envy of most any man. I'd sneak it out in the little box in my hand. Now getting caught meant getting fired, but I figured I'd have it all by the time I retired, and I'd have me a car worth at least a hundred grand. I'd get it one piece at a time, and it wouldn't cost me a dime. You'll know it's me when I come through your town. I'm gonna ride around in style, I'm gonna drive everybody wild. Cause I have the only one there is round. So the very next day when I punched in with my big lunchbox, helped my friend, left that day with a lunchbox full of gears. Well, I've never considered myself a thief, but Jim wouldn't miss just one little piece, especially if I strung it out over several years. Well, the first day I got me a fuel pump, and the next day I got me an engine and a trunk, then I got me a transmission and all the chrome. And now the little things I could get in my big lunch box, like nuts and bolts and all four shocks, and the big stuff we snuck out in my buddy's mobile home. And up till then, my plan went all right, till we tried to put it all together one night. And that's when we noticed that something was definitely wrong. The transmission was a 53, and the motor turned out to be a 73, and when we tried to put in the bolts, all the holes were gone. So we drilled it out so that it would fit, and with a little bit of help from an adapter kit, we had that engine running just like a song. Now the headlights, there was another sight. We had two on the left and one on the right, but when we pulled out the switch, all three of them come on. Now the back end looked kind of funny too, but when we put it all together and when we got through, well, that's when we noticed that we only had one tail fin. About that time my wife walked out and I could see in her eyes that she had her doubts, but she just opened the door and said, honey, take me for a spin. So we drove uptown just to get the tags and I headed all right on down the main drag and I could hear everybody laughing for blocks around. But up at the courthouse, they didn't laugh because to type it up, it took the whole damn staff. And when they got through, the title weighed 60 pounds. And I got it one piece at a time, and it didn't cost me a dime. You'll know it's me when I come through your town. I'm going to ride around in style. I'm going to drive everybody wild. Because I'll have the only one there is around. Red Rider, this is the Cottonmouth in the Psycho Billy Cadillac, come on. Uh, uh, this is the Cottonmouth and Negatory on the cost of this machine, Red Rider. You might say I went right up to the factory and picked it up. It's, uh, it's cheaper that way. What model is it? Well, it's 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59 automobile. It's a 6, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70 automobile. <laughs> Thank you, Bobby. Now, next week, you got to get us updated again on how many more pounds you're losing, okay?